What's happening Night Riders? So I'm back again with another requested video and this one is a very interesting one. The title is a little long. It says, Woman says guys are to blame for turning females crazy. <laughs> Women don't understand once you fuck them raw. Let's just get right into this. This should be incredibly interesting. Whew. Alright, let's start this. I'm going to make this quick. And I've, I've been wanting to tell y'all this. i got to make this quick because I had a big ass movie and it had fiber in it. And I'm starting to feel some things moving in my stomach. I just want to tell y'all real quick. Bitches have no fucking understanding once you fuck them raw. I'm going to say this again. Bitches have no fucking understanding once you fuck them raw. So, you niggas that's wondering why this bitch is crazy. This bitch crazy. What the fuck you thought? Don't, I ain't never met a bitch that Gosh, went fucking crazy over that. behind some condom dick. Y'all keep fucking these girls naked? Guess what? You're creating under crazy bitch. That's what you're doing. The whole entire time y'all fucking and you come straight on busting your nut, that's not what the fuck she thinking about. Yeah, she got her eyes closed and it look like she feeling it, but she not imagining your dick. She imagining y'all wedding. She didn't already picked her wedding dress. She already been chose her bridesmaids. She didn't chose your groomsmen. She's writing her vows while y'all are fucking. And she didn't print out out like... 400 invitations in her head already <laughs> and she done made y'all program she already know who she wanted to sing in y'all wedding when y'all get through fucking y'all about to get in an argument because she gonna want you to change your fucking facebook status it's a given like nigga you're no longer single i don't give a fuck what you had going on you're you're not single anymore you need to change that shit to in a relationship i'm telling you she done already planned to miss her fucking cycle this month she ain't about to have no cycle that you know of. She already planned to miss it. And guess what? She gonna have her friend taking her up to the uh, hospital to get a fucking pregnancy test done. Because she gonna be having convincing everybody that she thinks she pregnant for your ass. She gonna be sending you text messages talking about her fucking stomach hurt. She nauseous. <laughs> it don't feel right. Oh, my body feel different. My nipples hurt. All that. All of that. And then when she can't produce a baby, because we both know she, the bitch ain't pregnant. We know her fucking stomach empty as fuck. We know her, the bitch ain't pregnant, but guess what? When she can't produce a baby, oh, I had a miscarriage. Oh, she's going to have about three, four miscarriages for you. Yes, sir. Every That's fucking ridiculous. Month, she gonna, it's going to be a miscarriage. So you need to be fucking careful. She don't give a fuck that you told her that you got a wife and a kid and all that shit, shit. In her mind, she didn't already start claiming your fucking kids on her taxes. She didn't already start claiming your kids and she already put herself in, in that woman's place. Because you fucking her raw. All that shit called fucking girls raw, that's what that calls. A crazy bitch. So y'all better start protecting yourself. Cause ain't nobody gonna go crazy behind a condom dick. But when you when you do all this extra stuff, this bit bitch feel she feel like she's somebody because you fucked her raw. She feel like y'all are one. <laughs> So, if you don't want to deal with no crazy bitch, wrap that shit up, man. <laughs> um. She's not that far off, y'all. I mean, alright. First things first. If you married or you got a girl and you fucking somebody else, first off, cheating is wrong. I'm just get it out the way now. Cheating is wrong. But if you're gonna turn around and cheat and you're gonna fuck somebody raw, it's stupid. It's stupid. Um, like I said, cheating is wrong. I don't condone it. If you're single, granted, you're single, technically you can have sex with whoever it is that you want. But you can't have sex with everybody, girl. You can't. It's way too much shit out here 
for you to be going from one chick to the next chick to the next chick to the next chick all raw it's, it's, it's too dangerous out here to be doing that if you gonna fuck anybody raw she might as well be your girl um, next thing I want to point out if you're if you're gonna raw dog it first off if 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 you're having sex without a condom and you nut in her you're a fool like your chances of pregnancy are up there especially if she's not your girl um I mean like I said she wasn't that far off like chicks it I, I'm trying to choose my words very carefully but some girls do act real different once you have sex with them especially if you have sex with them raw um And that's because of the simple fact simple fact that women are emotional creatures. So it's 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 pretty much a known fact that having sex for them is different than having sex for us. Most guys have sex for the feeling and to get the nut out. Just I mean and, and to fuck the girl, pretty much. Women is more of an emotional thing. Now, granted, you have some women that can do the exact same thing. They'll fuck a guy, just for the feeling, to get up, get the nut off, and, you know, to fuck. <laughs> but majority of women are emotional, so it's an entirely different meaning for them. Um, but, like I said, she wasn't really that far off. <laughs> But it was hilarious. She said that she was planning a wedding. She planned your groomsmen while y'all having sex. That's that's hilarious. But I don't I don't doubt it. I, I wouldn't put it past it. Not certain girls out here. I wouldn't put it past it. So, night writers, post your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you thought of the video. And also, let me know if you think that she's right. Especially my female night riders. Let me know if she's right, if she's not right, or, you know, if she exaggerated certain things. Let me let me know. I'm not saying that you have to talk about your own personal experiences. You don't have to if you don't want to. But just let me know if you think that she's right from a woman's perspective. All right? Oh, man. Thank you very much for that requested video. That was... That was... Educational? <laughs> But I appreciate it. It was great. All right, y'all. So if this is your first time checking out my channel. Please join me and my fellow Night Riders as we strive for 500 by hitting the subscribe button down below. Fellow Night Riders, continue doing what you're doing as you comment, like, and share. Also, down below in the description box are links to my social networks. Please like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. I'd greatly appreciate it. And until next time, y'all, ride or die. We out.